you guys welcome back or welcome to my channel i hope you guys are having a wonderful day and a wonderful life of course as you guys already know today i'm going to be unboxing the galaxy book 3 pro so i've been pondering for about like a month or so on whether or not i should purchase me a new laptop because my old one is a macbook pro 2013 and since i don't really have any apple products the only apple product i have now is the ipad it wouldn't really make any sense for me to get a macbook because it's just been so easy for me to transfer all of my videos and the content i have on my phone to my pc so i also wanted a laptop that i'm able to transfer all of my content seamlessly into the laptop as well These are just some of the specs on the laptop. The battery is actually really good. It charges really fast and the battery lasts a very long time. I was trying to download Genshin on here. Unfortunately, it doesn't work that well and it just took forever for me to, to download it. Like I was at 20 something percent in like three days. So I was like, you know what, let me delete it. But besides that, throughout the entire time that I was trying to download it, the battery really didn't go down that much. So that was a good thing. That's something I did notice. here I'm just testing out my editor app that I use called CapCut. I do prefer using a keyboard and a mouse to edit my videos because I'm just so used to it and I also use an ergonomic mouse but it still works great and it still gets the job done. As always, I'm just testing on YouTube just to see the color display, how the video plays, and also on the audio, which the audio is actually pretty good. I think it has Dolby Atomus. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it or not. Baby, I'm trash at pronunciation, okay? But yeah, and it also has a larger touchpad. I think it's 20 or 30% than the previous book series. So I do like the larger touchpad. My fingers are not all cramped up and doing gang signs. So I really appreciate that, Samsung.
So the only games you're really able to play on here are very chill, not super demanding games. I'm just gonna show you two of them. I did try to play the Spider-Man game, which I'm gonna show you later, but it just did not work. It just was like, nope, you can't play it. So I haven't played Spirit Fair yet, but I just wanted to try this game out on this laptop. Honestly, the game plays beautiful, looks really good on the display screen, but I just wish that I was able to play Genshin and other games that I really wanted to play, but unfortunately, it's not the type of laptop for that. So let me know if I should like, I should just go for a gaming laptop. I'm thinking if it's a gaming laptop, I can also edit on there. Like it's not just for gaming. I could be wrong, but let me know. If you have any recommendations, please let me know down in the comments. So yeah, that's gonna be all for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. It took me a while to go ahead and finish editing this video but it's finally here let me know what y'all think and i'm also super duper excited on some future videos that i'm currently working on right now so be on the lookout for that thank y'all so so much for watching deuces